All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Bungo Stray Dogs Season 5, Episode 9. In the last episode, Two Big Revelations, number one, Dazai stays being smart as fuck. Um, kind of trap Theodore. Presumably, Theodore has some kind of backup plan for this. Um, but yeah, Dazai really came in with a big brain plan, had a gifted on the inside helping him out that could stop time when then which then hit the hair ability didn't work on Dazai, which is crazy um broken move and stop time wild and then on the other kind of side of the episode we had kenji who went mob psycho question mark percent mode and bro is literally insane it, like unstoppable like i got a bit confused thinking um his his uh, ability was actually mother nature in the last episode but it, it's just to defy the forces of mother, mother nature with his absolute strength basically but yeah really freaking cool episode i'm looking forward to this one so as always guys if you're new to the channel please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well and let's go into this episode right now ain't no way bro who's there to save aya come on Oh shit, what the fuck? Oh nah. Everybody's getting fucked up right now. The, 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 the little lady take him? Oh shit, yeah she did. Oh, flashback? Are they really giving this man a backstory? Is this the episode we defeat him? One of, this, one of these pretty ass Northern Lights as well. Aurora Borealis. Oh shit, here we go. Is that a hospital bed? What the fuck? It's so random just to have in the middle of a, a runway. Where did you pull this from? What is this random shit you found? Come on, Rampo. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. He's broken! Oh, shit, Rampo, no! He's not built for this damage. As long as Rampo is alive, there is always a backup plan. I'm not worried. That would piss me off if my nose was itchy and I was strapped down like that. Oh my god. Yeah, you'll let me free? What the fuck? Oh, she returned him back to his age as well. Oh, he came to her? Bro, bro is recruiting the wrong people, not gonna lie. I don't think any of the hunting dogs want to join him like this. Do some tricks? He's a whole tiger, ma'am. Jesus Christ, man. You really not believe him that he can beat him? The true goal? Is it something beyond what we've already heard? How the fuck did he dodge that? He's just using his time knowing him to dodge these kind of attacks? Wow. Someone that can take him on 1v1 and he hasn't even got the ability to help with this. He just let himself get stabbed in the hand. Damn. 
Yeah, he just pulls out the pocket knife? Fucking hell, bro. Oh my god, I, I forgot he could turn any weapon into, like, a devastating weapon. Oh, we're gonna have flashback of these two. Finally. So he beat 39 of a dojo, so he's about to get his ass whooped by Prez. Wow, they drew. Damn. War changed this little boy for real. He's still gonna die, though. His, his ability is ridiculous. His strength is ridiculous. What prison could hold this man? And in fact, the, the if he doesn't get his monthly surgeries, he's gonna die, die anyway, right? Yeah, the cherry blossom broke apart. Damn. The statue of the wooden sword. To drink a fine cup of sake under cherry blossoms is the life. He'd be right about that. One of the five great swords. Which you should respect. Is he really pissed off of him to this day because he didn't want to go to war? Like, what the fuck? Good. <laughs> he said no. Damn, so he took out the big wigs. And... Yeah. He went insane on the front lines. Demon of Carnage. Wow. Wait, what she just told him? Is this something we already knew? That, like, he revealed to a different character or no? Damn, bro, this sword is fucking cheating. Oh, what? Shit. You tell yourself that, bro. And he ain't gonna answer him. Damn. How are we stopping this man? Oh, damn. They were forced to eat each other? Okay, I see why he's trying to take out the angels now. I understand. But he's still gotta die. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. He, Fukuzawa did what Fukuchi wanted to do. 
He killed bigwigs. Not enough, but he did. And now uh, this man's been driven insane by, by war. Why is this one blank? Oh, okay. Interesting. Akhtagawa is one of these people that he's seeing right now. And there's Dazai. It's like, yeah, taking out all the people above and who make all the decisions sounds nice, but... He's, he's detective agency. He's got to do what's right. Can <laughs> the Dazai... Back to Dazai with this foolishness. Yeah? You're ridiculous, Dazai. Master manipulator. Yeah! <laughs> Bro would have swindled the place. Maybe he sees you as a good person? Maybe you want to join the detec detective agency? That'd be cool. <laughs> Makes sense. Classic Dazai. He's such a fool. I love him. Even out of a corpse? Oh. That's interesting. Oh, are we sure that he's dead? Do you want to like put a bullet in him when we get there just in case? Yeah? Why not? <laughs> They're his friends. So this is what, like, having actual family and actual friends is like. You should join the detective agency. <laughs> now he's using you as a footstool. The footstool. <laughs> yeah, he says Damn, killed her ass. How did you get out? I, I, I don't even need to ask it. I knew we'd get out. Your bond with the gravity manipulator. Oh, wow. That's ridiculous. Oh, yeah. Bro, these guys. This guy's two, always five steps ahead thinking, man. The both of them. Ridiculous. <laughs> Trial by flood. Servant of God. Wow. Ah, oh, shit, man. What do we do? Ain't no way out of this. We weren't expecting it. I'm going to complain about the goddamn cliffhangers every single ep episode of every single goddamn season that I've watched this. Because it never ends. <laughs> it truly never ends. Is it the same in, like, the, the source material? Like, do they always end on cliffhangers at the end of every chapter or whatever? Like, fucking ridiculous. Um, yeah, uh, who'd have thought Fyodor had a backup plan or for, he could foresee what uh, Dazai was planning. We still don't know this man's power. Bukuchi's still winning... And after she's on the way, 
I don't know, man. I see there is so much going on in this story. There's like four or five different plot lines, maybe even six. Aya is who knows what the hell happened to our Aya? Who who's there to save her? I can't even think where everybody is in the story right now. Actigawa's there. Bram's there. Fuck, man. I don't know. I'm not even gonna think about it. I'm just gonna let the story proceed, and I, I don't. Know. I'm not even trying to theorize this shit. Great episode, though, as always. Very much looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have an extra rest of your day, and peace out.